Station, this is your president. Do you hear me? We're going to have a delay. I can hear you. Do you hear me? I can hear you. Station, this is your president. Do you hear me? Hi, Kate. Hi, Ivanka. Do you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Do you hear me? I can hear you fine. Hi, Kate. Hi, Ivanka. Well, that's what we like. Great American equipment that works. And this isn't easy. <laughs> Roger that. No, it's not easy. We have astronauts and we have everybody. We're flying right now 17,000 miles per hour. That's about as fast as I've ever heard. I wouldn't want to be flying 17,000 miles an hour, but that's what you do. Yeah, it's pretty fast, but you can't feel it. Uh, Mars, what do you see a timing for actually sending humans to Mars? Is there a schedule, and when would you see that happening? I've been to Mars. You wouldn't believe the things I've seen. I was at the top secret base of Sidonia. Great. And what are we learning from having you spending your time up there? I know so much research is done. I'm getting a glimpse of some of it right here in the Oval Office. What are we learning by being in space? We're learning how to gain a foothold into the stars at Astra Perespera. Well, thank you. So well said. And I have to say, there's tremendous military application in space. Uh, we're rebuilding our military like never before. Uh, we're ordering equipment, and we're going to have the strongest military that we've ever had, the strongest military that the world has ever seen, and there's been no time where we need it more. And I'm sure that every student watching wants to know what is next for Americans in space. Uh, I'm very proud that I just signed a bill committing NASA to the aim of sending American astronauts to Mars. So uh, we'll do that. I think we'll do it a lot sooner than we're even thinking. Uh, so which one of you is ready to go to Mars? Are you uh, ready? And I, I think you're ready. I know you're ready, right? We just discussed that. She'd like to go to Mars very quickly. Who's ready to go to Mars up there? Yeah, I'm ready to go back. If you'll excuse me, Mr. President, I have a show to do. It's been real. I'll talk to you later. We are very, very proud of you and very proud of your bravery. Thank you very much.